Big 12 mascot time. We have some very, very strong thoughts here. And here's what you need to understand when it comes to Big 12 mascots. Big 12 fans, we like all of you. You guys actually like sports. We very much, uh, we very much like you. So again, if we are wrong on something, it is out of ignorance, but it is not something we are looking to do to offend. Okay, so uh, we've got we got five tiers here. You know, I'm nervous. I'm nervous. I'm nervous too. I don't know that I love the tier part because um, I don't want to offend our good uh, UCF fan, or our UCF fans, our good our our fans, our friends in the uh, Big Twelve. Oh, I got, I got this. I got this. Right. Be yeah, okay. I'm not a huge fan of this tier. Um, we will. Well, you know what? Let's. Uh, all right. Let's do this. Let's talk with the ones that we can speak on with a uh, authority authoritatively. Yeah. And ASU's our, last here. That's ASU's it. There's the only one. Jacob Franklin put that in last. Yeah. D. Yes. Okay. Perfect. D. All right. Now we can work upwards from there. Now yeah. the first one that I think Wil Wilbur and Wilma obviously at the very top. They are our gold standard. They will always be. Jacob Franklin put that up there very nicely. Very good. Now there's something that we need to talk about here. A mask. Oh. That really, I think, kind of won us over. Jay. Jay. Jay is impressive. When you meet Jay in person, Sheer and I were talking about it. Jay commands a room. Now, if we could, uh, Jake Franklin, if you're able to show this picture of Jay real quick with Jason Shear, look at this. This was something. Look at Jay. Jay went around, hobnobbing around, telling everybody how cool he was. Jay was amazing during all of this. Sheer, Jay is, Jay is at the very top. Um, I don't know that there's any place that we can't, we got to put Jay at the very top. I think the thing with, with Jay is that Jay was like with the media, you know, Jay yeah. was with uh, the people, you know, the yeah. other mascots were more just hanging around the players doing their own thing. Not Jay. And I believe that's, that's little Jay. That's baby Jay, right? So there's two J's. So there's little J and big J. We didn't know that. We just called him J. Yeah. But, that's baby J that was at football. Yeah. That I, I've confirmed this. But we put J at the very top. Agreed with the way that he ran a room. Yeah. But, and look how cute. Like he's got the one half because he's the baby. Yeah. Yes. I'm all in with Jay. We like J a great deal. Now, another one that really caught my eye was the UCF thing. Nitro is his name. Nitro was fierce nitro sticks out amazing uh nitro is when you watch nitro nitro commanded a room again also but he was different than jay jay was kind of schmoozing nitro was just basically dude i'm nitro come look at me yeah. i was impressed by nitro and i called him the ucf thing for the longest time but nitro i'm a big fan sheer yeah we talked about this we went over this nitro big fan Nothing crazy, doesn't do anything, but you look at Nitro and you say, you just say, damn, there's Nitro. Right. You know what's a, a very impressive about Nitro, too? He's very much of a meat and potatoes guy. You could just tell that Nitro was there to do business, get business, and then get out. I was impressed by Nitro. Nitro has a, um, Nitro has a, 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 a relevance about him that is very, very nice. Now, okay, so there's, those are the, those are two of them that stuck out immediately, Jay and Nitro. Now, another one that I think we need to talk about next is the Horned Frog. The Horned yeah. Frog is, that's another one. The Horned Frog is far closer to Nitro, in my opinion, than Jay. Where Jay is like me. You look at Jay and he might not be super impressive immediately, but then he breaks you down with his wit and humor. Whereas with, the, you know, Nitro just walks into a room and it's like Brad Pitt just walked into the room. That's also the way that the Horned Frog is. You notice the Horned Frog immediately, Sheer. Yeah, there were some mascots. I'm going to be honest. It, it took us a while to, to even recognize that they were there. Not not Super Frog. Not yeah. Super Frog. Mike Super Frog said, my God, that is Super Frog. And we yeah. noticed him right away. We are putting we are putting him at the very top as well, Sheer. Yeah, I'm all in Super Frog. Okay, now, one thing that I think we need to be clear on is that we're not going to, because we like all of our Big 12 uh, friends, so we are not looking to offend. Everybody gets an above average grade on this show, except for the ASU one, because that one sucks. Okay, yeah. now, there's some uh, ones that we probably didn't speak enough of that um, I think we need to talk about. That Cyclone is pretty cool. The Cyclone yes. Definitely underrated. I like Iowa State fans a great deal as well. I was impressed by, I was impressed by the Cyclone. Yeah, yeah, and, and you got to compare birds here, right? You got the cyclone, and you got uh, 
I think it's Sammy with Utah. You got to compare. And we just felt the Cyclone was a little bit stronger, a little right. bit more fierce. Yes, he was. There was a little bit of an edge to him. Like, it looks yeah. like the Cyclone. He looked like, you know, in his earlier days, he probably got into like a barroom duel and he's probably got a slash on his face that they have to cover up or something. I liked the Cyclone, though. I was impressed by the Cyclone. I put the Cyclone at the top as well. Uh, again. Mike, you're putting everyone at the top here. Yeah, because, well, yeah, because we're going to find some that we don't like. And I, Mike, I, you know you're allowed to use the other three tiers in the middle, right? Yeah, yeah. come on, Mike. I, I, I say, look, I'm putting the Cyclone. You can't all be S tier. Otherwise, S tier is useless. Yeah, they're all yeah. Good, except for like two of them. No, 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 Mike. No, right. Like, could you put them at A? Like, yes, what, yeah, what put them at A. Like, no, I'm with Jacob here. You can't okay. just have all of them on S. That's S-tier. weak. The That's weak. This? You gotta, yeah, you gotta have an opinion. That's weak. Okay, where are you putting it then, Sheer? A, just put them at A. Right, put them at A. I agree with what that. we're doing is those four in the S tier are the cream of the crop, and the other ones are good, they're just yeah. not as good as the top four. Okay, fine, fair enough. Now. Let's work a little bit backwards here. And again, I don't want to ra- draw the ire of our K-State friends because yeah. very much like K-State. And we will not use this thumbnail as a graphic, uh, Jacob Franklin, because I will get a lot of hate. We will just have a very generic because this will be a clip. But I am going to be to put the I am going to put the Wildcat at uh I'm gonna put him at C, man. Like yeah. I can't put anything in with ASU obviously, but man, this is really a, when you, he was, this was basically a dude walking around with a mask on. It was frightening. It was frightening. It was a dude walking around with the mask on head. We don't know what's under there. There wasn't a lot of personality. It was kind of like, I'm strange, you know, look at me. And it just, it didn't have the same vibe as the other mascots. Yeah, I don't, uh, I don't really, I don't really get it to be honest with you, but he was very, um, uh, it, it felt like, it, here's what it felt like with Willie the Wildcat. It felt like he was just kind of mailing this in. Yeah, just kind of there because he had to be, you know? He was, he was just kind of there because he had to be. I wasn't impressed, but I like the fan bases. So, again, we're not going to put anything else uh, than, all right, now, we've got to talk about some ones that came with guns, 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 guns. All right, now, the Red Raider, my friend, the Red Raider. He definitely sticks out. He definitely sticks out. Um, we're A tier, all- Jacob. A tier. I'm going to put him at an A tier because he definitely yeah. wanted to smoke toe tree. And, yeah. you know, we, we I guess we give him credit for that. But with, uh, though, this is a very, this is a very, very impressive um, uh, uh, thing up close. And that guy uses that gun. A lot of personality. That's yeah. the thing that stood out. Toe tree said, oh, that guy talked crap about you. He, Pistol Pete pulls out the gun. Right, right away. Right. Very yeah. impressive. And 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 he and it looked like he had done this before. It looked like he had done this before as well. I was not uh so again, oh somebody does Willie the Wildcat have a girlfriend? I don't think that Willie the Wildcat, I think he's too lazy to have a girlfriend. That's where I came away thinking that. Yeah, year. yeah. I don't think he has a girlfriend. Not that we know of. But no, that one was very, very good. Very uh, very impressed by the uh by the Red Raider. Now, there's one that creeps me out a little bit here. Um and I don't give him a lack of effort like I give the uh, like I give the uh, the uh, the Kansas State Wildcat because again, just putting a mask on is not. I mean, that's what we do at Halloween when we don't. That's like the guy that puts the uh, uh, this is my Halloween costume, dude. That was funny like ten years ago. All right, but the Mountaineer, I don't love the Mountaineer. Um, the no. Mountaineer reeks kind of beta energy, to be honest with you. It was weird. It was it was. It wasn't intimidating, and you would think a guy with a big gun would be intimidating. Yeah. It was just it was just kind of weird to me. Maybe a little uncomfortable. I I wasn't impressed at all. And he had this very like weird, like it looked like he was trying to go with like it looked like he was trying to go with some kind of uh how do I put this? Um it looked like he was trying to be like Davy Crockett or something. And I guess you're a mountaineer, but I don't know. It didn't do much for me. Um, I am not listen with this with the uh Kansas State one. I think that the C, at least, but at least it tried. So I'm going to give it a B. I'll give it at least a tried. It was all made up and everything. What say you? Is that am I being? Oh, I would keep it. I because, dude, the C, the C is really for a lack of effort. A C is a total lack of effort at this. Yeah, point. he did try. All right, we'll give him B. I think he's. I think he's in between. I, I think he's closer to C than B. But I'll, I'll give this one up to you. Okay. Yeah, I. I would. All right. Okay. We'll go B. We'll go B. B. We give A for. We give a B. We're going to give the effort here, and that's. Uh, 
That's a big thing. Now, Dennis Walsh, the great Dennis Walsh says, am I the only one that hates the wildcat hand thing? That thing wasn't a thing until like three years ago. And old people like my mother do not know how to use it. So they keep flashing crip when they think they're flashing wildcat. My mom keeps going like this and it's like, no mother, you're not doing this right. I don't, I don't really get it either, but, um, Are you saying I, Janet's not a crip? Yeah. Well, no, Janet's not a crip. Yeah. I mean, you know, mm. she listens to nip hustle, but let's be honest. I mean, okay. Back to, uh, back to other stuff. Now, Hmm. Where should we go next? You know, one that was kind of nonchalant for me in this whole thing. And I just kind of, he had colors and everything. And he reminded me of Oregon, the Baylor, Baylor the Baylor one didn't do much for me. Bruiser and Marigold, um, did do a ton for me. I didn't notice him. C tier, Jacob, C tier, C tier for sure. Just because I, I didn't, didn't, you still didn't notice him. He was the only mascot. You didn't really notice, you yeah. know, remember we were the only time I saw him is when I just, I thought it was some kind of Oregon thing. And, uh, yeah, it just, didn't really do anything, didn't interact a ton, was just kind of there. Yes. I mean, he was there. He just kind of showed up. Now, I I, I don't know that I want to put him. The Kansas State one, though, I, I guess we'll put it with him. But the Kansas State one, it's really just a lack of effort. Yeah, but I don't. I mean, if, if the Baylor Bear was unnoticeable, isn't that kind of a lack of effort, too? Yeah, that's a good point. You're not doing your job if you're unnoticeable. So yeah, we'll put that. All right. Now the bear cat, um, the bear cat does not impress me. Um, first of yes all, and I, no. yes what? and no, yes and no. Sorry. Go ahead. Go ahead. Well, the bear cat. First of all, Sheer thought the Jayhawk was actually a bird. Sheer was wrong. We found out the Jayhawk was not a bird. Um, first, and then you got the bear cat. The bear cat seems like something that they would have blamed COVID on. It's a weird looking, uh, it's a weird looking animal that looks like it, you know, was probably in a cage at some point. I, I the bear cat doesn't do a ton for me. Uh, the only thing that stands out about the bear cat is I'm pretty sure it was like six, two. Yeah, it was large. Yes. He was, uh, he was but yeah, nothing really I, C tier, right? Uh, I say C, I think B is pretty clear here. Yeah. Yeah. Fair enough. Fair, fair enough. All right, put him there. I agree with that. I agree. The, um, hold on. Let's see. Yeah, all right. We'll throw him in there. Um, all right, now, let's, uh, what else do we got here? Oh, uh, everybody likes the BYU thing. Uh, uh, what is that? Cog? Mike and I were not impressed. I, he he I looks can't... like he's got no soul behind those eyes. Yeah, like, like he looks look sad. Eyes, there's no soul there. I, I came away thoroughly unimpressed. I was expecting big things, and, you know, maybe it was just an off week. But I didn't, uh, Cosmo didn't do did much. nothing for us. Nothing. Yeah. Cosmo did nothing. Maybe it was an off week. Maybe there was an illness, but Cosmo just did nothing for us. Yeah. Nothing, nothing. So I'm going to dude. honestly, I'm going to put him at, yeah, I'm putting him at, yeah, I'm putting him at C man. He did nothing yeah. for me. You know, yeah. I, I don't know what else to say, but he's going, he's going C. All right. Now the Buffalo, what is that? Ralphie? Yeah, they were fine. They were solid. It's fine, but did I ever tell you in the the Buffalo did fart at me one time when I was in Colorado for a game because you could go down on field level and it was very bad. Um, but the Buffalo is fine. I like the Buffalo. I got no problem with the Buffalo. I'll put the Buffalo at a B. Yeah, solid. Did its job. No complaints. Right now, Jimmy Lee um just said, uh, like I said, Cosmo used to be great, but the guy that used to be Cosmo is long gone. Yeah, it just doesn't have a just doesn't have the same vibe. Okay. What do we have remaining there? Oh, the Oklahoma State. Uh, what is the Oklahoma State? Well, it's a cowboy, obviously. Pistol what is the Oklahoma Pete. Pistol Pete? All right. Um, hmm. I love that guy. That's a that's a tier to me. I really, really was impressed by Pistol Pete. I'm not going to put him in the S tier, but I'm putting him in the A tier for sure. He uh, and he had a. The thing about him too is he had energy to him. You watched him, and he had some real energy. I was impressed by him. And, um, yeah, I came away saying, yeah, that is the absolute best, uh, type of mascot for a Mike, uh, Mike Gundy led team. Uh, yeah, yeah. I liked him. The face is a little weird, you know, right. that was the difference I felt between him and the, the Texas tech one, but I like him. He's solid right now. Okay. Now what, uh, what else do we have here? Oh, we've got, uh, the Houston one confuses me. I don't know why its name is Shasta. Yeah, I don't like it. They look boring. Sorry, my God. There's some there's some breaking women's basketball. Yes, I was gonna say Arizona women's basketball breaking news. Yeah, I don't. I it does nothing for me. Shasta did nothing for me. Whatever. Um, I'm putting him in that C group. Didn't do it. Yeah, down. nothing. Nothing for me. Whatever. You know, it's kind of just you're there. 
I kind of wish that I could put Kansas State like down a tier, but I can't put anybody with ASU. Because the Kansas State one was just really disappointing. Like, yeah. Because it was just it. no effort, man. No. Can we put hey, can we put ASU like off the screen and then no, it, that's <laughs> can we come up with another? Yeah. Oh, Jacob, watch Jacob Franklin. He's gonna come up with another tier. This is great. Okay, yes. Yes, this is good. Oh, this is great. All right, yes, new. Yes, and just put, just put like just put <laughs> perfect. Yes, but perfect. Then, do we agree that we should move the Kansas State one down? Yeah. One? Yes. It, move again, Kansas State to D. Yes, exactly. It did. It did nothing for me. But put Kansas State in there, Jacob Franklin. Okay, now we have. Uh, what do we have? Two more. What are those ones? Oh, uh, Shasta. I'm putting Shasta. I'm putting Shasta in that. Shasta's with this. Hey, no, Jacob Franklin. ASU is at the bottom. Um, I'm putting. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm putting Shasta in with the C's. Sorry. Yeah, That's yeah one. I agree. I yeah. agree. All right. So, all right. Now, I feel this is good. Now, who else? What is this right here? What is That's this Utah. Like? I liked Utah. I yeah. thought they were very active. Yeah, I'm cool. That's with a B to me. What's that? I think I think the Utah's a B. All right. I'll put, Utah, I'll put the Ute in there as well. Okay. This wow. is some pretty good work. But, again, the one that I just kept coming back to was the connection that Jay made with Shear. It was... It, it, it was big. It was big. Tried to get a phone number. Wouldn't happen. Tried nope. to say, hey, you want to hang out sometime? Yep. And Jay probably also realized, too, that Shelby was there so that that was not going to necessarily work. But either way, we're a big fan of Jay. What's a Ute? Yes, from uh, uh, my cousin Vinny. Very, very good. Oh, very good line. 